Only a handful of games remain for area basketball teams, some of them squeezing in non-conference matchups late in the season. That includes a border battle in Caledonia. The Warriors welcoming Onalaska to town. We're jumping straight to the end of regulation. Toppers down by three with 10 seconds left. They got to have it, and Jack Cole delivers. Shooters bounce, and that ties it up with seven to go. We're headed to overtime at 79 apiece. 10 seconds left in that frame, and again, on Alaska trails by three. This time they go to Isaac Skemp at the top of the key, and he buries it. It's time for double OT. 87 all, and Caledonia scores first. Garrett Cones with a sky hook to push them ahead. Back to back on Alaska baskets. Adam Skifton lays it in, and now the visitors lead by two. Nodded at 91, Skemp again shooting a three, and it is good as Onalaska takes the lead back. We're under a minute to go. Lewis Doyle driving, but Ethan Stendhal is wide open in the corner. It's 94 to 94. Toppers didn't score, so that sets up a final shot for the home team. They put it in the hands of Doyle. Clock ticks to under 10 seconds. Only one defender on him, and then he's going to decide to keep it himself. Off glass and bank it in with 3.2 left. Signaling ice water in his veins as Onalaska takes a timeout. There's going to be one final prayer for the Hilltoppers, but it's no good and the game is over. 96-94 is the final. Five straight Caledonia points to close this one out. A thriller of a contest, just as advertised. Uh, me and Mason King, a two-man game, and I get downhill, and if, if his guy helps, I kick it for the three, and if he doesn't, I try to get the best shot I can. Uh, it's huge. We've we uh, love the opportunity to be able to play them every year. We lost them last year, so it's great getting them back this year. Perhaps not much of a surprise, but both teams set a new season high in scoring in this one.